I'm home. <laughs> what? What are you looking at? Oh, this? Funny story. I was driving home from the grocery store and I was about to turn onto our street when I saw this little guy just walking around by himself. He looked so cold and so scared that I just had to get out of the car and pick him up and take him home with me. <laughs> isn't, he, isn't he pretty? Look at his eyes. His eyes are all blue. You don't, you don't see that in black cats very often. I mean, I had a black cat as a child and she had green eyes. She was, she was so, 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 so pretty. You know, it's more common for black cats to have yellow eyes because of the melanin. Something about melanin, I don't really remember at the moment. I'd have to look it up again, but look at, he's, he's so cute. No, he, he's not, he's not starving. I mean, he's light, but he's not skin and bones, you know what I mean? And he's got, he's got a good healthy coat, so I don't think he's been out very long. I don't know. I, I don't know his name. What's your name, little kitty? Meow. Hmm? What's your name? Meow. Just call you kitty. <laughs> okay, so I was thinking the cat could stay here for tonight. And then I will drive him down to the vet in the morning just to get him checked out. Just to make sure everything's okay and that um, there are no underlying health issues that we need to worry about. Plus, I think if he does have a family or if he does, um, like if he got lost, then if there's a microchip in him, then the vet can I, I think I think what they do is they scan the microchip and then it comes up on the computer and there's some identification on there some phone numbers some names yeah if you have a family we can get you back to them yeah but they're worried sick looking for you yeah Okay, um, can you just hold him for a minute while I see if I can find some food? And then I need to go out and get the groceries because I left the groceries out in the car. Okay. You, you stay. Stay right there, okay? Yeah. yeah. It's okay. Good kitty, good kitty. It's so adorable. Okay, now I remember when we looked after the neighbor's cat that I still had food in the- Aha! The pantry! Bingo! Okay, let's see, do we have enough? Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, he seems hungry, but I don't think he's starving or anything. Okay, there we go. There we go. And let's, um... <laughs> Yeah, I, I personally don't like wet cat food. It looks... Uh, you know, I, got, I got some dry stuff, but that should be good for now. 
I don't know what he's been eating before, so I hope that his stomach will handle this okay. Usually I... Usually I'm worried whenever I feed an animal something different than what they're used to because their tummy will hurt, they get indigestion, they get that. But I think, I think this will be good for now. Okay, get him some water. There we go. Okay, are you ready to eat, little kitty? All right. You wanna put him put him down on the ground and see what he does? Oh, okay. Um, do we do we still have those? Uh, no, we don't have a litter box, but maybe we can get um, do you know those training pads? Yeah. We still have those. Okay, great. Um, uh, do you know where they are? Okay, I think, yeah, yeah. Perfect, those will be perfect. Okay, we'll just, yeah, we'll put one down near the door, just in case. Okay, so, yeah, you can come on here whenever you need to do anything, okay? And we'll just, we'll just clean it up, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Or, or, wait, 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 wait. Okay. Hold on. I'll be right back. Okay. I think this would be good. I mean, I usually bring groceries home in a bag, but coincidentally, I decided to bring them home in a box. <laughs> yeah, that's... I honestly don't know how... I got the box, but this should be good. If we take these out, okay, that, and we put the box here near the door, and we put the pad inside. Perfect. I mean, it's sort of like a litter box, except there's no kitty litter in there. There's just a draining pad. Yeah, usually those are for puppies, but they work for kitties, too. Here we go. Well, did you eat all of that food already? No. Goodness, you must be hungry. Okay, now do we have any blankets? Do we have any blankets for him? I mean, I don't have a... I don't have a... I don't have a kennel or anything, but if we just put some blankets here, that'll be good. Or, you know what? I think, I think I'd be more comfortable if he slept in our room with us, you know? Just, just for tonight. Until he can go back home again or whatever. Okay, there you go. Go. All right. Here, good kitty. We'll just let you lay down and get some rest, okay? Okay. Good kitty. And now it's time for us to get ready for bed. You know what's funny? It's almost Halloween. And there's a full moon outside. We had Friday the 13th this year. And now there is a black cat in the house. Yeah. Look at him, all curled up, sleeping. You know, if, if we can't find the kitty's owner, 
if we can't find the kitty's family or whatever, I... What do you say we adopt him? <laughs> yeah, I, I'd love to have a cat. But at the same time, you know, if he does have a family, I don't want to, yeah. Okay, how about this? If the kitty does find his family, whenever the time is right, we can go to the shelter and see if there are any other kitties who need a home. Yeah? Does that sound good? Okay. Well, for now, let's all get some sleep. And who knows what'll happen next? <laughs>